Oh, wait a minute. What the fuck is Richie telling you all this? He thinks I'm with him. Really? What gave him that idea? It's what I wanted him to believe. I've been playing him. I seen this coming all along. That's why I made a big deal of that coke. I raised a non-issue and he fell for it. So you're like a double agent now, huh? Fucking Matt Helm. Fuck you. Your license and registration, pal. Hey, Tony, what are you doing here? I got something for you. What is that? Fifty grand. Get the fuck out of here with that. Why? Because I'm a paraplegic? My idea was for you to donate it to the Spinal Cord Injury Foundation. Hey, I'm going to walk again, Tony. I know you are, Beans. But in the meantime, you, you donate, you get your picture up, you inspire people a little oh, bit. Oh, oh, wait, you mean be like a fucking poster boy? Is that what you mean? Just take the money. You can whack it up with the foundation. Fuck you, Tony. Tony, this uh problem with the red tag garbage dumping in Payton City. Okay, Christmas. He wants to talk about medical waste. Just want to double check that the way he's paid for us to go down there. We reached out to the EPA guy like we told Barone. That reminds me, Tony. Dick called this morning. I'm fucking talking. Stop fucking interrupting. Oh! The fuck is wrong with you? Hey, fuck you. Hey, 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 buddy. Davey. I saw your wife out there alone. I figured you for the trotters. Not tonight. I had a customer I couldn't shake. Guy spends half an hour in the same between a $20 soccer ball and a $22 soccer ball. So what do you like? Oh, no, that guy from Bowden seems to be making some sense, I guess. Well, I'm in a game tonight. Oh, ho, ho! You guys want to be alone? <laughs> <laughs> I saw that refreshment table out there. I knew you'd be lurking around in somewhere. I don't know how he's getting roped into this shit. Well, Charmaine's no fool. She knows one of your shrew, your dad, in the right mouth, and her daughter can go anywhere she wants to go. So far, the janitor is the only one going near them. Well, that's a nice career path for a young lady. <laughs> fuck you. I want to go get one of them belly bombs. Have I said fuck you yet? Trips. Three deuces. Cry me a river. Three beautiful kings. Flush. You motherfucker. You slow rolled me. What the fuck were you doing in that hand? His money's good. He wants to sell. It's his business. Fuck you two. I should stay with my guma tonight. What the hell is wrong with him? What do you want, Tony? He couldn't bring this in himself? What, I can't even come in and say hello? What you want is to know if I heard the disgusting shit they're saying. At least have the guts to come out and ask me. It isn't true. You know what? Fuck you. Fuck me. Fuck you. You gotta put your son in hiding because of your fucking philandering? Afraid he'll get caught in the crossfire, your own son? Christopher's upset, that's all. He could come over. He could say some things that a kid shouldn't hear. Just please leave. I don't even want to look at you. See, I got business associates who are black. And they don't want my son with their daughters, and I don't want their sons with mine. Fuck you. See, that's the kind of thing I'm hoping to avoid. Don't yell. Don't scream. Old cutlery stays right where it is. How's the bagels in this place? Come on, you don't answer my calls. I got no choice. Walking away is a choice. Ruining my practice, it's a choice. You got your office back. No harm done. One of my patients committed suicide because I wasn't available to her. You know what that means to me? She can't eat bagels. She can't call in sick because she's feeling blue. She's gone. She's in the ground because of you. I don't deserve your help. 
I hate your fucking system. I told you. Fuck you. You know, Tony, I know it's not your favorite subject, but we had some really great news about Ma at the hospital today. Her rehab therapist says she's making tremendous strides, and it's not going to be long before they release her. How can she make tremendous strides when there's nothing wrong with her in the first place? It's called face-saving therapy. The patient has to believe that they're getting therapy. Believe me, Medicare is not going to pay for it if it's not as necessary as real, would they? And the taxpayer foots the bill. Well, it's not much longer now. But she's going to need a place to stay. She's out in the street. Tony, it is her house. Dead people don't have houses. Daddy bought that house. Tell you what. Take her back to Green Grove. What, the nursing home? The retirement community. You know I don't have that kind of money. Fuck you. My stomach hurts. Stupid fucking moron. You realize what could have happened to you? We didn't have connections? Some cop goes by the book and they charge you with attempted murder. You hear me? Attempted murder, then what? Then what? So he shot you! You just gonna let him fucking get away with it? I told you that's my business, not yours. And what did you do? Nothing. Zero, a big fucking jerk off. Fuck you! Oh, you're gonna break your fucking neck. Stop crying. Stop crying. A wise decision on both your parts. Now, what I'd love to see is a truce. Wipe the slate clean. The no-shows, the wire room, veto, put it all behind us. Yeah. Your brother Billy, whatever happened there? All right, then. Nah. Whatever happened there? The shooting. Whatever happened there? God rest his soul, man. I'll tell you what fucking happened. This piece of shit's cousin Calm put down, six Phil. bullets in the kid without any provocation whatsoever. My cousin's dead. Fuck you. Phil. Hey, we were making headway here. I didn't mean to Fuck say... Fuck what you meant, cocksucker. Come on.